In making photographs, the real number one question is not how to photograph. The number one question really is what to photograph. Once you've determined what to photograph, the next question is where to put the camera. Many times I'm asked uh, what advice I would give to young photographers. I give myself the same advice on a daily basis. You have to, you have to perform your own visual signature. You cannot get any place imitating the work of the people that you admire. As a photographer, I remain fascinated by the alchemy of light on film. Photography takes uh, initial information and you make a strong photograph of it. Something has changed. You have transcended the subject. Uh, some years ago, I was approached by Leica to, to design a camera that I would consider to be the, uh, my dream Leica. Well, I had a lot to say on the matter. And uh, we came up with uh, my signature model, which was done in a limited edition of 50. And it's what I use, of course. Currently, I'm working on uh, performance pieces that include my photographs incorporated into, into black and white films, silent films that are projected uh, behind me as I, as I play my compositions musically. When I first started photographing, I really believed, uh, as did many photographers of the time, that documentary truth was the so-called paradigm of, of photography. And I attempted and I learned some of those techniques of the photographer, the documentarian on the street. The first photograph I made with a Leica was uh, in, in Chinatown in 1961. My instructor, Paul Hassel, generously loaned me his uh, M3. And it was no turning back. Many times people ask me, what is my favorite photograph? Well, uh, for many years, I would have to say it was a picture of the priest because it had a certain religious context. It was extremely minimal. It was strong black and white that almost appeared to be color. The, the image was compressed by the frame, which is a very difficult thing to do. It suggested that he was attempting to burst out of the confines of the frame. But I would have to say now my favorite photograph would probably be my next one.